Tonight, scorching temperatures hotter than ever recorded in parts of the Pacific Northwest, including Portland, Oregon. I can't move around outdoors. As a life-threatening heat wave now extends to parts of seven states, home to 33 million people, all under emergency heat alerts. What do you do typically when temperatures get to be 100, let alone 110? Uh, well, we're out in the morning or the evening, try to stay out inside during the hottest part. Temperatures up to 30 degrees above normal in spots, with expected highs like 117 in Palm Springs, California, 110 in Medford, Oregon, 98 in Boise, Idaho, 104 in Seattle, an all-time record. Official temperatures are measured in the shade, but here on the street, this is measuring at 157 degrees. It feels like a furnace. Heat is the number one weather-related killer, especially threatening to the homeless and elderly. Volunteer groups are now loading up water to anybody that might need it. The county has 80,000 bottles ready to be delivered. More than 200 people now sheltering in the Oregon Convention Center, serving as an emergency cooling center. The peak of this historic heat wave will be Monday along the I-5 corridor, including another all-time high expected for Seattle. Only slight cooling midweek, the heat holding on inland through the week. Rob Marciano, ABC News, Portland, Oregon.